go along with them for now? That doesn't sound good. We have a process, our own way of doing things. Your guys better not have a problem with that. Things don't go well for troublemakers here. I hope that's clear. No problem. You won't have to worry about them. Didn't sound that way. They just need time to get used to things. I hope you're right. Come on. Where are we going? Kate asked for you. I thought you'd want to check on her. Listen, Javi, Gabe... He told me some pretty messed up things. Things I need your help wrapping my head around. He shouldn't have done that. I... wanted to tell you myself. Bad news is bad news. Who cares who delivers it? He told me you lost Mariana. Just a few days ago. Oh. I'm sorry, David. She's... She's gone. It's strange grieving for the same person twice. Like losing something you didn't know you had. What was she like, Javi? She was so little when we got separated. Who did my little girl become? We got along well. Her smile kept me going through a lot of rough times. That... must have been nice. How... how did she die? Tell me how it happened. Please, I need to know. She was just standing there, minding her own business. She just found her lost headphones in the dirt. She was smiling. And then someone put a bullet in her head. What kind of animal would just open fire on her like that? An animal with your mark. My people aren't in the habit of killing little girls. David, I was there. They shot Kate, too. Ask your buddy at the gate if you don't believe me. Max was a part of this? went down out there. I need to know exactly what happened. They ambushed us in a junkyard, just unloaded on us. They chased us back to this town, Prescott. Their leader flooded it with walkers and, and tear gas. Leader? A crazy bald guy with a beard. Badger, what the fuck have you done now? I'm gonna handle that stupid son of a bitch, okay? Do me a favor, keep this to yourself. The politics here, they can get messy. I thought you were the boss. There's four of us that run, Richmond. You need to impress the other three. Or you'll be back on the road by morning. Try not to stir things up. You and your friends could have a very short stay. Fuck that. They'll have to drag me out, feet first. Cut that shit out. Well, that'll be exactly what happens. I run security here, but it's not like my word is law. This shit with Badger doesn't make things any easier. Who's the fresh meat? Ava is my brother, Javi. The baseball brother? <laughs> no shit. What are the chances of you turning up on the doorstep? My brother talked about me. All the time at the start. All good, I hope. I think you know the answer to that. Ava's my right hand. If there's anyone you can trust in Richmond, it's her. That woman, the fucking soldier. She was the first person I met up with after you and me got separated. I never would have made it without her. Gabe said you went back to the house at the start. I'm sorry I never found you. We waited for you for three months. Eventually the house was overrun and we had to move. Why didn't you come back? 
Mama and I got routed out of the city on the way to the hospital. It wasn't long before she... Poor Mama. I couldn't get back into Baltimore, so I hooked up with my old unit. We thought we could build a safe zone outside D.C. After what happened to Mama and everyone else, I thought you were all dead. But you were taking care of them, weren't you? Somehow you found a way. I wanted to leave, but they had no one. How could I abandon them? The hobby I used to know would have found a way. This is where they're treating Kate. Don't get comfortable. We're not staying long. Hey, kid. Got everything you need? Uh, yeah. This place is like a resort. Check it out, Javi. Noodles in a cup. We need to get you some real food. Stat. Turn you into a soldier. <laughs> Javi. I'm glad you're okay. <laughs> I'm a lot better seeing you. good to have you back. Look at this family. Look at my wife. Isn't she the most beautiful woman alive? Come on. With the lights off, you could mistake me for a walker. I'd have to agree. The key word being alive. Gabe. Uh, what, you okay? Uh, my... oh, shit. I'll get the doc. I'm fine. I just needed to talk to you. Alone. I'm scared, Javi. More than I was the whole time on the road. Even when I thought I was going to die. Everything inside me screams to get away from here. These people are killers. And David? Well, what about Gabe? He seems pretty happy to see his dad. Gabe will do what we say. We've been taking care of him. It's always been you and me on the road, Javi. That's how we've made it this far. Please, promise me we'll go back to that the first chance we get. This place, it's a cage. I don't know, Kate. We were on our last legs. Javi. Whatever problems this place has, it's worse out there. For you, maybe. Whatever. Just please, please don't leave me alone for too long. Feeling better? How you doing, sweetheart? David reported some pain. It's less now. Strange how it just comes and goes. I think she pulled her stitches when she sat up. Her stitches? I doubt it. But pain often comes in waves with abdominal wounds. <laughs> I'll give you something to take the edge off, in case it comes back. Truly superlative work. I thought I'd have to operate, but all she needed was IV fluids and some antibiotics. How did you find someone with skills like these? A wound like this kills 9 out of 10. Whoever did this really knows their stuff. That would be Eleanor. One of my friends you threw in quarantine. Well, she's no use to anyone there. We should let her out. I'll vouch for her. Agreed. I'll have Ava bring her here. I want to meet this Eleanor. I'm sure she'll be an asset to our community. You can't just cherry pick who you want. Why don't you let them all out? Can they all perform surgery on a dirt floor with a pair of pliers and no anesthetic? There's your answer. Javi and I have to go meet some people now. See if we can't prove he's worth a damn. We're gonna take real good care of you. Okay? Send my apologies, David. I won't be able to make it. Feeling okay? Fine. I just want to keep an eye on my patient. The others know my vote is with you. Come on. Remember what I said. 
when we meet these guys, keep what happened to Mariana to yourself. Badger is one of my guys, and I will handle him. It may look pretty, but it's all sugars. There's no substance. It tastes pretty, Clint. That's all that matters. Ah, the brother. Javi, meet the guys. Clint runs food production. The crops you saw, that's him and his people. Jones, our bridge to the outside world. She handles contact with other settlements. Pleased to meet you, Javi. I trust you've been treated well. I hope you haven't been handled too roughly. Some of our people left their courtesy with their old lives. <laughs> oh yeah, the cell you threw me in was totally five-star. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> we have to be careful. I'm sure you can understand. <laughs> we were just about to eat. Clint was trying to convince me of the essential superiority of his cream spinach over my magnificent Black Forest Gateau. It's no contest. The spinach has real nutritional value. Javi. Take a look at that table. You tell me what you'd rather put in your belly. Spinach from Clint's garden or a baked delicacy by yours truly? I'd have to go with that cake. I haven't seen anything like that in years. <sighs> Suit yourself. Come on, Clint. At least he's being honest. Please, make yourself comfortable. We value straight talk here, so please, forgive me if I seem direct. We're usually pretty strict about who we open our doors to. Your brother's word counts for a lot. Is that so? The three of us and Dr. Lingard make all the decisions here, so yeah. People who choose to stay with us, they have to deal with us bossing them around. Not saying you wouldn't, but it can be an adjustment. Especially for the more independent-minded. There's no structure out there now. People get used to doing as they please. I always do what I'm told. Ask my older brother. You're gonna fit in well, Javi. I can see that already. When Joan and I met your brother, he was trying his hand at fruit. Fruit? We found him slowly murdering an orchard on the Shenandoah River. Hotty fucking ha. Huh? I helped him bring it back to life. We had a good run there. For as long as it lasted. What happened? What always happens. We trusted the wrong damn people. That's what led us to start this. Wondering what this fine piece of body art is all about? I've seen that mark a few times. You probably saw it at the gates. Right, Javi? We all took it as a sign of commitment. It was a crude answer to a difficult problem, and it hasn't always worked. Please understand. We had a terrible winter just after we moved here. We... we lost a great deal. Loved ones who left holes in our lives. Protecting my people from that kind of pain, that's what keeps me awake at night. It turned me into a perpetual night owl. I know how you feel. Seeing the people I care about suffer, it, it's a terrible feeling. I just want to shield them from it all. It's a noble aim, one worth fighting for. Max? What are you doing here? I sent for him. Since when does he answer to you? From what I hear, he's well acquainted with your brother. They exchanged a few bullets outside our walls. Is that right? Is there bad blood between you and Max? Nothing that can't be worked out. Let's just say I wouldn't invite him to my wedding. Yeah, I wouldn't fucking go. Good, because I just said you wouldn't be invited. Max, how did this start? Don't look at him. You have an obligation to tell the truth. We caught him siphoning gas from one of our vehicles. Max. Sorry, David. I know he's family, but your brother's a thief. Is it true? I was scavenging whatever I could find. I had no idea it belonged to you. If you just asked, we'd have given it to you. That 
That's not all. He shot Rufus. In the back. You did what? We found the body near the wreck of Rufus's truck. You cold cocked me with your pistol. I woke up in a truck with cable ties on my wrists. That don't make it right. Rufus was bringing you here. We wasn't gonna hurt you. This is who you're asking us to vouch for, David? Seriously? You know we can't just open our doors to killers. We're trying to build something different here. Everything I did out there was to protect my people. That's more than I can say for you. I'm not sure what you mean. Javi? You have something to say? One of your people, some asshole called Badger, he put a bullet in a little girl, my niece, David's daughter. What? Damn it, Javi, I told you I'd handle it. No, David, this cousin fucking dirtbag has the balls to accuse me. He and Badger destroyed an entire town. That's enough. No, we need to hear this. Go on, Javi. Sounds like you've got more to get off your chest. They killed a hostage in cold blood. A woman, Francine. Badger did that, not me. You were right there next to him. I tried to get him to stop, I swear. Cut off her damn finger first. Max! I tried to stop him, I swear. He was out of control. David, we warned you about getting your soldiers in line. We don't know all the facts. We know enough. She's right, David. You've lost control. I want them gone. All of them. Take Javi and everyone in the quarantine to the gate. Send them out with enough weapons to defend themselves, but no more. Look, we can't fight this. Not now. Kate and Gabe will be safe here. Your doctor friend, too. But the rest of you... You're gonna have to do what they say. Are you fucking kidding me? Just play along, okay? I'll help you when I can. Just stay alive. Okay?